First person implanted with Elon Musk's experimental brain chip, Neuralink, sharing his remarkable story this week. 30-year-old Noland Arbo is paralyzed from the shoulders down. Take a look. The first person implanted with Elon Musk's experimental brain chip, Neuralink, sharing his remarkable story. 30-year-old Nolan Darbaugh is paralyzed from the shoulders down. You just played some music? Yeah, yeah man. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> now he can play music or chess, use a smartphone, all with just his thoughts. When he was 22, Nolan says he jumped into a man-made lake and sustained a spinal cord injury. His mom is his full-time caregiver. I didn't have anything to wake up for in the morning. Um, and this has changed that for me. What can you do now with the chip implanted that you could not do prior? I can control a computer just like anyone else can. The chip connects to his brain with threads thinner than a human hair. In recent weeks, some of those threads retracted, affecting his abilities. We rolled up our sleeves and found various different ways to, you know, for Nolan, be able to recover his performance, which we have successfully been able to do. Nolan telling me he hopes his story can help inspire others with spinal cord injuries and that one day paralysis can be reversed. It's going to be amazing when someone can have a spinal cord injury, go into a hospital, get surgery, and walk out a couple days later. I think it's going to happen. I don't think it's as far away as people might think. While the Neuralink device will have no effect on Nolan's physical ability, he says that it has improved his quality of life greatly. Neuralink tells me they intend to implant the next two participants in their study in the coming months. Will Reeve, ABC News, New York.